Hey everybody, so here's another Star Destroyer update. The Navy Aggressor Gray is down. It's been about 24 hours. I just masked it off. Uh, took probably about 40 minutes maybe to get both sides. I left the back alone for the moment. On the next color pass I'm going to do uh, some different colors back here on the engines. I didn't mess with the neck too much as far as any dark grays go. But overall this should be good. That should be more than enough for this darker gray once uh, the final white comes up. So uh, next up is the light sea gray. And here's just a quick shot of it with the light sea gray fully applied. I've already forgotten what the old gray looked like to uh, know how much of a difference this is. It should be fairly subtle. So, another 24 hours and I can mask this layer off. There will be more of this than there was the dark gray. And then uh, the final white, I should have that purchased by uh, tomorrow, the day after or so. And here's a look at the final masking to uh, get this light gray down. Next up... We're going with Rust-Oleum's Clean Metal Primer, and this will be the base white. It's not a super bright white, it's kind of muted, but it's not really a gray. It's a really nice one I use often. So, uh, this is it for the tape. Over here on this side, I just don't know what to do about the details on the back here, so I'm just going to do it all one color and possibly change that up later on. So, uh... That's pretty much it. Here comes uh, some paint. And here it is all painted up white. So next up I gotta start pulling some tape and we finally get to uh, trimming the beard off of this model. So stay tuned for those episodes and I'll catch you later. See ya.